Well, the weather is getting colder and many stray animals are still on our streets and animal rescues are working hard to make sure that dogs, cats and all animals are safe from harm and stay warm. Our CW 39 Houston's Carol Willis is live from Katy based rescue Wheaton's in need. So Kara, they have been doing this for 25 years. That is absolutely incredible. 25 long years and get this Wheaton's in need operates throughout the U.S. and Canada but Gwen here she is the founder of the organization and she does it here in Katy solo by herself it's a big job and she's got two beautiful pups here with us today she's going to tell us about what she needs to help operate this organization what you can do from home and how you can donate so let's go ahead and start Gwen by talking about um we talked about your mission um, we've talked about your love for Wheatons in general. They're right. beautiful animals, but it's Christmas time. So we find that a lot of people, I'm sure you've seen it, people are buying dogs, cats as gifts and tossing them out whenever they see that they get too big. Why is this harmful? Well, it's, it's not the time at Christmas to get a puppy. Puppies are underfoot and you've got all the family coming and it's just not a good time to get a puppy. Uh, so springtime is great because you're going to have to have house training and it's much nicer than what it is here today in the spring <laughs> for a puppy. Um, the one that pet peeve I have is about people getting puppies off of the internet and that way you're usually getting a puppy that's been bred in a mill and all they do is put a couple of dogs together. They don't do any health testing or follow-up testing like if you got a any dog not just Wheaton's but from the National Club uh, our Wheaton Terrier Club is South Dakota Wheaton Terrier Club of America and on there there's a breeders list and that way you get a Wheaton from a reputable breeder you'll pay a little bit more money but it's worth it in the long run you're not paying out vet bills later what are some questions you can ask if you're about to purchase a dog Okay, has the dog been tested? Every breed has some sort of problem. Uh, Wheatons have uh, protein losing problems. Uh, there's, Wheatons can also be dysplastic in, in the hips. So you want to know if the breeder has done the testing for hip dysplasia, for PLE, which is a protein losing problem, or PLN, also protein losing problem, uh, and, and other things. So, some breeds have to do, uh, well, we have to do hips. Uh, some breeds have to do elbows. So you want to talk to uh, any breeder about the testing of, of the, the sire and the dam. Okay, so ask all the right questions. Our pups are not just a Christmas gift, so keep that in mind. And also, Gwen, we want everyone to be able to support you and your rescue. So tell us how we can learn more, how we can sign up for volunteer opportunities, and where we can donate. Okay. We are, <clears throat> sorry, Wheaton's in Need is a nonprofit 501c3 organization. Uh, we're over, you know, 25 years now. Um, and you can donate on our website, which is wheatonsinneed.org. Uh, there is a donate button on there. Um, you can also send me checks. My address is on there. My phone number is on there. And I'm always happy to talk to someone about not making a mistake uh, of buying a, any, any kind of breed puppy. So education is so important. Please go and support Wheaton's in Need at that website that was on your screen. We'll have more from Gwen coming up. Ido and Sharon sending it over to you.